Hey guys, we finally received our electric scooter from Amazon. It's the Hover One Journey. Uh, this video will be an unboxing and a quick test of this product. I believe this is their newer model uh, with some minor differences from the previous one. It was on sale for, I think it was $2.98 and we bought two, one for me and one for my wife. Um, it has a range of about 16 miles, but I guess it depends on your weight. Uh, on the box it says it has a max speed of 14 miles, but I believe it can go as fast as 16 miles per hour, depending on the terrain and inclination. Um, one of the major upgrade on this model is that it can now support up to 264 pounds as opposed to 220 from the previous model. Charging time for the battery is around 4 to 5 hours. Um, the scooter itself weighs approximately, I think, 27 pounds. So um, once you open the box, you'll realize that the handlebar is detached from the main column. Also, another key difference with this model is that it has a much more simpler locking mechanism, which is now located in the front. Here's how it looks outside of the box. Um, it's encased in plastic. Attaching everything is very, very easy, and it should only take you about a couple of minutes. And once you're done, you should be good to go. Here's a quick demo of how to lock in your column. You just bring it up and lock it in. Included in the box are your charger, your tire pump, your manual, some screws, and an Allen wrench. To attach the handlebar, you just simply slide it in into the column. With your Allen wrench, you lock it with four screws two at the front and two at the back. Here's your kickstand at the left side. And here's a closer look at the back tire with its disc brake and it also comes with a tail light that blinks when you activate its braking system. And here's the front So to turn it on, you just press and hold the button until the light comes on, showing you the battery and the speed indicator. You'll also realize that the, um, the bell is located on the left side of the handlebar. This scooter also comes with a front headlight that can be activated by quickly pressing the power button twice. Overall, we are very satisfied with this scooter. Um, the build and finish of this product is high quality, and we highly recommend it. So if you guys have any questions, please comment below. Um, if you like our video, uh, please press the like button. We will definitely be making more videos of this product. Um, we're going to be riding it everywhere in the city. So thank you guys for watching and please don't forget to subscribe. Thanks.